my name is Dr. Deborah Younger, and I have always wanted to go into medicine since I was a little child. It's always fascinated me, and I've loved it my entire life. I sort of moved up the ladder from volunteer at my local community hospital to a nurse's aide, to a RN, to a, a then I went and got my uh, PA, and then I went and got my MPH in international health, and I trained community health workers, and I, I, I went to medical school when I was 35. I, I liked working in the ER, and they were opening up a new a freestanding emergency room in an area called, uh, um, in Dorchester County. It, it was way out in the country out there, there at that time. And with my background in public health and training community health workers and working in remote areas, it, it appealed to me. I could do like third world medicine and still be living you know, here and have time with my family. That's sort of you know, a long way around. And then I just loved it. I just, it, was, it was just right for me. Dr. Younger's been working uh, in the Charleston market for over 30 years um, at the Somerville ER. There's just nobody within our system who has the knowledge that she has. Over the years, she has taught most of the clinicians that work there. She's seen a lot of things that I've never seen, including, you know, the, the start of HIV. She just has so much knowledge that she's willing to share uh, at all times. She is known for her kindness, her dedication to the department, how caring she is about her patients. She is an amazing person um, and clinician. Having the ER named Dr. Younger's honor is um, about as high of a you know praise that I feel like a community and a hospital system can give somebody. I have never seen an ER physician have a um, emergency room named after them. Um, and so uh, to me, it was just an incredible honor for her. So I welcome to all of you to the Dr. Younger Emergency Department, where dreams are just not meant, they're real. I was not expecting it at all. I, it came out of nowhere. Absolute shock. <laughs> I. I was um, humbled, <laughs> I was honored, I was a little embarrassed, <laughs> you know, um, I, I was, um, it was an incredible honor, uh, but I, I, I did not expect it at all. I thought I was going there to say a few words about the ER that's been there for 30 years, you know. It's, um, I, I have a big fondness for some of the ER, it's my, it's my work family, so. And I worked at a lot of other hospitals in the area at the same time over the years, but always Somerville's been my, my heart.